is something that's a crisis. Because what happens if your company goes broke? You know, if it falls over, if you lose everything that you have, you're still alive. You know, when the decisions that you have to take regard are regarding your life and your death, everything changes. If you fail, it's black, it's kaput, there's nothing. If you lose all your companies, what do you do? You become a taxi driver, a waiter, you can create another company, you can develop other things, but you're alive. You know, that's the main difference. And there's nothing in business, in the world, that can compare to fighting death. There are questions that will never have an answer. People look for answers, there are no answers. Life is like a puzzle, you know, with thousands of pieces. Some of those pieces sometimes are not nice. Always people want bad things to happen to other persons. And those other persons want bad things to happen to us. So it's like a mixture of good, bad things that happen in life. And it has happened all through the ages and millenniums. And people live, die, are successful. Some are not. Some are luckier than other ones. It's life. It's like that. We planned. We like to have a, we would love to have a life like the one we planned. But I don't know what I'm going to do tomorrow. I'm here having an interview with you. What's going to happen tomorrow? I don't have a clue. You know? Because I, I know, I realized that I planned for my life when I was very young. And it changed completely. And in the wrong way. People want to achieve success very easily, very fast. It takes time. It takes one day at a time. You know? Uh, I was not a very good student, not a bad student, an average student in the world. And I had to give a lot of math exams because I, and go to private teachers to teach me math. And I think it's, you can be very bright and you cannot succeed. You know, it takes a lot of effort every day, every single day. Effort, physical effort saved my life. And working hard gave me a nice life afterwards. I was not, and I don't think I'm very. Some of my friends say, you are retarded, how did you get there? And I said, no, I just never stopped. So I always say, we all have our Andes, Andes sometimes in life. So fight, walk, never stop.